Hey. Oh. Hello? How did you get in my house? I thought they were here. Okay, I'll be there in a second. No, I thought I, I thought I heard you inside. You said hi, I'm here, and I heard the echo from here go through the place and then into here. This is Nick, my best friend, and uh, this is a. Uh, uh... Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> We're yeah. gonna eat. I take him soon. What are you gonna have? So we're back. They're ahead of me. We got ice cream. And pub sucked. <laughs> Food was great. Everything else sucked. I literally could not eat it. <laughs> okay, so I know this isn't a generic. Okay, I know this isn't a generic like vloggy position, but I mean everyone's always sitting or standing with it, so and I'm lazy right now. Even though I'm holding this up in the air with one arm, yeah, I know. <laughs> As you saw, uh, my best friend came and my girlfriend came, and we had a good time. The reason that I wanted to talk today was because I feel like there's something important that you have to think about in your life that you know might be hard. To admit, the friends you choose are important. The people that you have around you is what makes up who you are. You know the saying, you're the summary of your five closest friends? This is what I pretty much mean with, like, you have to choose the important people in your life. And the, my best friend Nick that you saw before, he's been my best friend for, I would say, eight or nine years now. Because we've, uh, met in math class and then I helped him with math. I mean, so Asian of me, right? After that, we ended up being in the same choir class and then we became friends and then he helped me get a job at a Dunkin' Donuts because I lost my job at another Dunkin' Donuts and he was like, hey, we can use someone else at the one I'm at. So we ended up working together and then through that we became best friends and yeah, it's we've been best friends ever since. When you grow up and go to college and go out of college, it's harder to hang out as much, but we're still close as ever. The thing is that when you're best friends, you don't always have to hang out all the time. It's great to, but you don't always have to. People believe that you always have to. So what am I trying to get at? It's important to choose your friends wisely, but if the friends aren't bettering you, or providing value to your life and they're making you, they're throwing your life down or doing something negative to yourself, then you shouldn't cut them off completely, but you shouldn't hang out with them as much. You want positive influences or people that make you into a better person and you're able to make them into a better person. And I know that might sound kind of shallow, but you could do your best to help others, but people can only help themselves at the end of the day. The reason I bring this up is because I feel like that I try to do my best to be both a great best friend while also being grateful to my best friends for what they do and provide for me as a person. I'm just happy. <laughs> I'm grateful for the close people I have in my life. My roommates are fantastic. I have a wonderful girlfriend. And the people that I'm able to call my friends and my best friends, I'm very lucky to have. I'm the person I am today because of how my family raised me and how I've learned from both the negatives and the positives of friendships. But I wouldn't be where I'm at now if I didn't make the right friends or keep the right friends by me this whole time. I know it was a kind of a spontaneous day with how everything went today. Hopefully you still enjoyed it. This is a more interesting and serious podcast. Uh, but this isn't a podcast. This was a more interesting and serious video today. And with weird angles and me holding this a lot, even though I could place them on the table. Hopefully you still enjoyed it. If not, hopefully if there's something else I can help with. Just let me know. If you have any questions or you just want to talk or have a nice friend, I'll be here for you. Until then, Hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you in the next one.